Hey guys, welcome to another video. And today we're playing some Lego DC Super Villains. And uh, as y'all see, like in the title of the video, uh, this 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 I'm gonna be making a uh, Hasbro Hotel characters from a uh, Hasbro Hotel. I just finished watching the season finale of season one. And if y'all wondering, no, there will not be spoilers in this in this video but I'm just gonna recreate some of the characters and the customization of this game and uh, do some missions or whatever uh, playing as them anyway let's go ahead and do this alright y'all so I just got them making the characters as y'all can see this one's supposed to be Charlie right I know that it doesn't look exactly like her suit it kinda does but I was trying to be as close to, to the original as possible and here it doesn't where I made like baggy I got her like Beer and everything yeah. and the other two characters I made I only made four because some of the characters will be kind of like impossible to make in this so the other two characters I make it this would be Alistair right the, the closest I could get to him and the other one that I made was Lucifer in the show you see I gave him like the whole white aesthetic and stuff like that and, uh, yeah so the first thing I want to do with these new characters I made is do one of these uh, things in, in this. Can I not change? Like, wait a minute. Don't tell me I'm stuck at this character. Wait. Uh. Quite a few. Hours. No. Oh my gosh, hold up y'all. Alright, and we're back. Yeah, it turns out when I was trying to go big with like my Alistair character, it wouldn't let me like, you know, change the character. So I removed the ability to make him be like large. And plus I already did that with like uh, Lucifer anyway. Anyway, we're just gonna only use the characters to try to get the golden brick in this like little level. <laughs> What? Jesus. Alright. Let's see if we gotta make all of those. Okay. Let's see if we can do that. That doesn't work, okay. Alright, it says that we need Joker for that. But actually, I think let me just use uh use pro with this one. Oh, we need someone with a grasp. Okay, that's why it says that we need Right. Don't tell me that I did the same thing to him. Okay, there we go. Wait! I can't use this? <laughs> Looks like the joke's on me. Okay. Alright, now let's go back to Charlie. Alright, so look like they wanted to do this one. Okay. I think I gave that ability to, um, I don't think I gave that ability to anybody, Jesus. I didn't know how use, useless my character could be in this one. Hold up, y'all. Hey guys, look, it's Charlie driving the Batmobile backwards. <laughs> Alright, y'all, so, I, I wasn't able to find a level where I could use these char characters that actually, and them actually doing something, so I'm just gonna use them to unlock this character. My beloved Tico has disappeared, and I don't know where she's gone. I can see that she's in trouble, but I can't see clearly enough to know where she is. Can you help me find her? My first of guess course. would be that place that sells seafood in Chinatown. She always loved fish so much. All right, let's go. Dang, he fast. Wait for me. Okay. 
go away. So we're going to China. Chinatown, I mean. She's not here! Oh, Tico! Where are you? Oh, I didn't give these characters uh, tracking abilities, so... Those are gonna have to use a, a different character for this a little bit. The man who never misses isn't about to start. She's left a clue! Deco, you genius! Okay, so the arrow was pointing towards the police station. <gasps> that makes sense! She loves teasing the police dogs! Alright. Alright, then get back to it. Oh, okay. Mm, all right. Ooh, up. Uh, all right. I got this. Ooh, maybe stealing pets wasn't our best idea. Got him. Mm. There we go. Oh my gosh. Hmm. Can't see her here. What if the dogs got her? Another clue. Seems to be pointing toward the chemical factory. That's strange. He never goes there. Alright, let's go. Alright, this time, all these are in this time. <laughs> Sir, got him. Right, there she is. Get those guns. All right, can I move, please, so I can do it? All right. Get them monies. Mink, mink, mink. All right, you got it. All right. Oh, Tickle, it's so good to see you again. Are you okay? Let's go get some ice cream, my dear. Aw, ain't that cute? 
Alright. I'll, 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 I'll come back to y'all once I find another character that I want to put with the next two. Alright guys, so, this next character that we're going to do, we're going to do it at Apocalypse this time. Because, you know, Apocalypse kind of kind of looks like hell in the show, kind of. Alright, here we go. Yeah. Hey, hey, if y'all enjoying this video, comment down below uh, which character of Hasbun Hotel is your favorite. Mine has to be uh, Lucifer in the show. He just freaking <laughs> he, he's something else. All right, so. Oh, I never even unlocked the uh, thing to give me more options in this thing. If that makes sense. Jesus. I haven't done a video in a while, y'all. There we go. Can I exit? There we go. Now, which character sh should we unlock here? Him. Oh, Jesus, my freaking stick, my freaking left stick. All right, how about we do him? All right, let's go. No, a nice dinner won't be enough. All right. My wife Barda is mad at me. I've been spending too much money on escape room experiences when we should be saving. Really? I need to make it up to her, but buying a gift will make it worse. I've really? decided to retrieve something of ours from Granny Goodness's orphanage. It's where we first met, you know. Unfortunately, my expertise is in escaping, not entering. All right. Right. Now let's right, see let's if go. we can get inside the orphanage. <laughs> Going into an orphanage. I don't know if that would be a good place for Alistair to go to, but um, we'll, we'll see. Hey, state your business. I'm escorting this woman for Granny Goodness's book club. You wouldn't want to keep Granny waiting, would you? N no, of course not. Please proceed. Oh, you lucky that they ain't gonna make us fight. <laughs> I can't believe that worked. All right, now we just have to find my old room. The door is locked. Can you get it open? I'm no good at this. Oh, come on. Why is it that mostly everything that's hidden in this game has to be deal with that? <sighs> this isn't exactly in my wheelhouse. Someone else will need to try. I should be able to deal with this. Well done. Now let's see what we can find. Alright, then get back to <laughs> Hmm. Alright, let's see. How about we Ah This was our favorite toy to play with as kids. Maybe there are a few things in this room we could take. Keep looking. Aw, look at this cute picture of us as kids. This is perfect. Oh yeah! Barda's favorite teddy bear! Here we go, and finally this. This should be enough. Now, let's get out of here. Alright, this time I'll just play as Alistair. This time. So I just discovered that breaking into a room is the same as breaking out of one, but the door opens the other way. It's all starting to make sense now. Uh, Thanks for your okay. help. I'm sure Barda will love these old mementos. All right, I keep care of that, but I feel like that just ah that probably like that would be too quick. Let's do one more and then I'll end the video. All right, I'll get back to y'all once I get there. Actually, I changed my mind. Since we already helped the other dude, why not help her now? Welcome, short one. As uh. you can tell from my commanding height. <laughs> Yo, I'm imagine if I chained it to Lucifer with that one. That would have been crazy. For the Proto Fury's flurry. Oh, 
You aren't prepared at all. Do not worry, tiny one. I shall explain. <laughs> you will face my finest fighters as they are itching for combat and must be tested in the heat of battle. Let us not dilly dally around. Put up your guard and prepare for the fight of your until now forgettable life. All right. Attack, my free fury. All right, let's do this. We are the unstoppable force. Better battle formations in Granny Goodness's retirement home. Y'all probably can't even see them. Who's next? Who's next? Okay. It would appear my proto furies are somewhat lacking fury, along with yeah. guile and pretty much everything else. I must forge them into deadly fighters before I can present them to Granny Goodness. Okay. I thank you for being the most worthy punching bag in Apocalypse. You have shown my proto furies the value of a skilled fighter. Until we meet again. Small one. <laughs> I still, I don't think <laughs> that would be a good idea to call him small when he and I just made him this freaking huge. Anyway, guys, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Uh, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye.